Hello and welcome to this video tutorial on the Illinois Driving Information Resource available at the Prospect Heights Public Library. This online resource is available for people preparing to take their driving tests and includes practice tests, handbooks, and more. To access the Illinois Driving Information Resource, please go to phpl.info to access the library's main website. Once you are there, in the left-hand column, choose Online Resources. Then, choose Databases Alpha. This will give you an alphabetical list of all of the online resources available at the library. You can then scroll down to the Illinois Driving Information Resource. Once you have found it, click on the title of the resource. Once you are in the Illinois Driving Information Resource, you can use the top bar in blue to navigate between parts of the resource. This includes practice tests, which are divided by car, motorcycle, and commercial driving tests, handbooks, as well as a frequently asked question page. By clicking between the different ones here, I can move between the different types of tests. It starts with regular car tests, then motorcycle, then commercial driving. The handbooks page brings me to the different handbooks that the site offers, including the driver's handbook, motorcycle handbook, and commercial driving license handbook. It also offers handbooks in other languages, including Spanish. Finally, it offers a frequently asked questions page, which provides a step-by-step -step guide to what you need to do in order to get your Illinois driving license. If I scroll back up to the top of the page, let's take a look at some of the practice tests that it offers. As you can see, we're currently in the car test portion. If I scroll down the page, I can see that there are several different practice tests available at different levels, including easy, hard, hardest, and then finally an exam simulator that gives you an idea of what the actual test at the DMV will be like. If we look inside of the practice tests, we can access them by clicking them. Then you can see on the left hand side, this grid with numbers shows you how far you are in the test and whether or not your answers are correct. You can tell that on this test you need to have a score of better than 80% in order to pass. You can choose the answers by clicking on the options. You can also choose for the resource to give you a hint by choosing the hint option below. So if I select an answer and it's correct, it will show green on the little box. I can then say next question by going underneath and choosing next. If I get an answer wrong, it will show me on the left hand side a red box on that question. It then gives me an explanation as to the correct answer below. If you have any other questions about using the Illinois Driving Information Resource, please contact the library. Thanks for watching.